Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to today's stream. It's been a long time coming, but we're finally going to uh, finish off Muff Love Extra. As you know, all we have left is Sumika. Now, I know some people will, uh, anyone who's new to the stream are going to be very confused when I uh, skip all the previously read dialogue, but we've done every other route now, apart from Common Ending 2. I'm not sure how to get that one. Maybe it has something to do with doing Sumikas instead of Mayas, because I did the first uh, common ending with Maya, so maybe Sumika would be something to do with that. But we'll have to wait and see, won't we? So let's, uh, without further ado, let's uh, get back to it now. Uh, now we've got to start from a certain point, don't we? Um, I'll have a quick look at the guide. Right, so... So right, there is a... Right, Sumika's extra route. Okay, so it's to do with Sumika. Fair enough. Maybe I'll unlock that naturally. Right, so we start from... Yeah, we have to start right from near the beginning, don't we? From here. Yeah, we've got to give her only positive reinforcement. <laughs> Alright, so auto-skip. We should do that first. There you go. Well, I suppose it was pretty fun, yeah. <laughs> I mean, she did give away his food to a dog. <laughs> and, you know, that wasn't very fun for him, I'm sure. You're a real piece of work. Not only was I deprived of my precious Mountain King Matsukake meal and forced to settle for a hamburger, but then you went and fed my fries to that damn dog! <laughs> Is it just me or does she not sound very sincere? It's not just me, right? Nah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. No, don't worry about it. I've decided to pave my own way in life from now on. So. No way. No way. That isn't the Takiru we know. Maybe you should consider doing the same. <laughs> uh oh. Wait. Let's calm down and talk things over, shall we? Only barbarian self is violus. Stop! <laughs> Alright, we've already seen that before. No need to see it again. Auto skip is still on, right? Yeah, it didn't. It goes off whenever the. Um, auto skip goes off whenever uh, a cutscene or something happens. <laughs> yeah, we gotta turn that down. <laughs> Wait, that's not the issue here. <laughs> I love how you can literally ask for something so legendary as that meal. <gasps> Yowch, what the heck was that? Ah, oh, he's dead. <laughs> Although it's weird that not all the dialogue skips. It's kind of weird. I don't understand why that happens. Gotta pick Sumika. Sumika, give me those chopsticks. Uh, oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, Tama was really bigging up Maya's meal, wasn't she? That's why she looks so surprised. A spork? Really? <laughs> well, you know, since I can't eat both, obviously. I owe you one for not eating it yesterday after all. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, carbonation, damn it. <laughs> he can be when he wants to. <laughs> What's the matter, Tama? You seem down. 
I'm sure Maya will give it you. <laughs> she thought she was gonna get some too? Aww, she's so considerate. Yeah, you deserve it, Tama. Fine by me. It'd be a waste if no one ate it. <laughs> it's okay, it's no thing. Uh oh, I forgot to hit record on local recording. That means that this, uh, this VOD on YouTube is not going to be the best quality. I apologize for that. I can set it to record now and we'll do a swap over. That'll probably work. Here we go. Sorry about that, Maya. Uh -oh. Who's messaging me? They're not messaging me, they're messaging a group chat I'm in. Ah, oh, damn it. Just let me close that. And that. And that. And I guess even that. Alright, back to the game. Sorry about that. Well, that's very open-minded of you, because that's just how Maya is. Maya is incredibly, incredibly, uh, uh, what's the word, uh, kind. That's what, that's it. That, that'll do. Come to think of it, Maya, aren't you gonna eat something? Fair enough, I guess. Oh, I see. Enjoy your lunch, Maya. <laughs> yes, I'm sure it is. Yep, she gets all these top class chefs making food for her. It's a wonder anyone would turn them down. It's so weird. Combination, combination. <clears throat> Feels like I've got a burp. <laughs> no. Beats me. But for some reason, it makes me feel a little uneasy. Well, whatever. Anyways, let's see. Uh, hi. Uh... Uh, I don't need you feeding me, Sumika. <laughs> Are you an idiot? Oh, oh my gosh. Look at that! That is great. I hate how I have to do that to hide the text. It's so annoying. Because this game doesn't really give you the gallery until you clear a route, so... Thumbnails are a real chore with this game. But of course Umika's not paying attention, why would she? Jeez, I'm not in kindergarten. Did you really think this was an age-appropriate lunch for me? It's true. You chose it, so you're gonna eat it, right? That has nothing to do with this! At least she's acknowledging me. <laughs> Good idea. First off, you didn't pack enough in here! Healthy young men need more nourishment than this! There you go, she's taking everything on board. She's very attentive. On the other hand, my gullet isn't big enough to eat Maya's lunch on top of it. Use the sizes of today's lunches as a reference when you make tomorrow's, okay? <laughs> Do something about all these embarrassing kitty foods. I mean, octopus wieners are kinda cute. <laughs> What men need is guts, toughness, backbone! <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't believe she went there. No, I couldn't believe she went there. This is Sumiko we're talking about. 
Don't try to change the subject. This is serious business, alright? Next time, make me a lunch that just oozes with manliness. Her lunch for tomorrow finally makes sense to me. If you remember, manga meat. <laughs> that oozes toughness. It's meat on a bone, after all. That's a manly thing. Sumika, my dear, you are the only route left. Of course I'm picking your lunch. <laughs> no man knows what the future might hold, but I do. I mean, it'd be pretty rude, wouldn't it? Really rude. Exactly what it sounds like. Now, try to wow me with your cooking skills. There, all done. <laughs> eats eats his lunch hand fed to him and then doesn't and then doesn't even make a promise to eat the Lex lunch after making all these demands it's just Takiru see this is what happens you call Takiru nice once and then he does something like this unbelievable competition is the basis of capitalism do your best <laughs> well we all know he is but man, that seasoning was pretty good. I guess I should have expected that much from you, Sumika. You really do get me. <laughs> and then he goes l l of a verbal embarrassment of barrage like that. Uh, wait a second. Took her all morning to get that right, so I hope you're grateful, Takiru. Uh, idiot! What the heck? Why are you getting all embarrassed? Why wouldn't you do your best when, you, when you're cooking for someone else? What the hell, man? Don't act like that's such a huge deal. But you did make it sound like a huge deal, Takiru. Pretty much. <laughs> he is a bit, isn't he, I'll bet. That, that's not true! I'm gonna go take a quick walk to help my lunch settle! <sighs> well, that was definitely a bizarre lunch period, but in retrospect, maybe it wasn't so bad. In fact, this situation might be described as somewhat of a lucky break. Hold on a minute. Yeah, auto skips off again. <laughs> See what I mean? It'll turn itself off randomly as well. Now, I think we run away, don't we? Oh, we clean. I guess we should do that. <laughs> yeah, we'll be good. Whoops. <laughs> uh, here he is. Yes, yes I did. <laughs> yeah, I might have said something like that. Well, here she goes. The manga meat. <laughs> Sumika, please. I'm sorry, Maya, but I can't resist the appeal of manga meat. Manga meat? Yes, yes, that's right. You heard him right. This stuff. Mm. Now that, my friend, Matt, my dear, is a very interesting and very in. in, uh, in uh, bleh, bleh, uh, sorry. That is a very, very good question. What could a piece of manga meat come from? You'd think it'd be from a cow or something, right? It's big enough. Stop! <laughs> Don't say it. It must not be spoken. Manga meat is simply manga meat. Nothing more, nothing less. So, so? Come on, Sumika. You should know this. You found it. In any case, I've always dreamt of eating this, so... God damn it, Maya. You're so understanding. 
Pretty much. But at this rate, <sighs> I guess Mikoto wants them to. Oh, wait, no. We didn't follow it. I, it's, been a, it's been a while. I forget who was interested in the manga meat. Was it Tama? I think it must have been Tama. Yeah, because Mikoto's all about the fish, right? Yeah. Maya, you should let Mikoto have that. Please, don't ask me why. <laughs> I guess being Takiru's friend can really have benefits, eh? There we go, everyone's happy for him. And I am too. We're all happy. Everybody's happy. What? Hey! Don't hug me! <laughs> oh my god. Confusing feelings. Stop it! Get off me! I don't swing that way! <laughs> oh dear. Huh? Ah. Oh. I guess every time she meets up with him, she meets up with Sukiyomi. She's basically like, he didn't bite again. Is this really working? Oh well, now I can enjoy the manly lunch Tsumika prepared for me! Yatta! I mean, it's a shame really, because we know why uh, Maya is even here at all. And obviously, she's not going to get what she wants. Which is sad, because we know what's going to happen to her because of that. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> well, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Manga meat. <laughs> right, do we wander aimlessly? Oh, we go home, I guess. Looks like we're being the going home club. Ah, uh, right, yes, because now we have to play Valgrenon. Now, I honestly don't think it matters. I really don't think it matters. Alright, we'll advance. Keep moving. Keep maintaining distance. It doesn't matter because we're going to lose. We always lose no matter what we do. <laughs> I mean, at least this skip feature goes much quicker than others. Sumika! <laughs> Help me, Sumika! <laughs> Kagami Sumika. Well, this one's a safe bet. Good enough for me. Whoa, it's pretty it's pretty neat and easy to read. It's surprisingly girly. Well, that's not very nice. <laughs> Kinda out of character, honestly. <sighs> He's such a rude man. Oh, I found a weird habit she has. She writes her eight starting from the bottom. Wow, analyzing someone else's handwriting is pretty fun. I mean, yeah, I never start an eight from the bottom. It just doesn't feel right, you know? Well, of course we're eating your munch, Sumika. All right already. Yeesh. What choice do I have? You were so focused on getting me to eat with you today that you forgot your own lunch. <laughs> because he's known you m long enough. You're just too predictable. Why? <laughs> no, he picked mine. Don't do anything to jeopardize this for me. Huh? I know, it's luxury pork, we get it. Yeah, I know, but... I think we'll eat both anyway, won't we? 
Oh, Mikoto, don't be mean to Sumika. <laughs> Hmm. A very wonderful idea, Maya. <laughs> I know, right? A meal you can turn, two meals you can turn into a big meal. It works for everyone. Everyone gets to try some too. It's all good. Uh, really? Sounds like a plan. This one I don't think matters. I went to the archery range. Was that a good choice? Yes, it was a good choice. Here we are. Sorry guys, this uh this game has a very awkward thing where it like close like it goes into a sleep mode when you click out. I mean, it's happened every time I played this game on stream, so you know this by now, but it's always I I feel like I address it now. Apologies for all this uh clicking out, but you know, it has to be done. Howdy there. She's right. It's like a completely different world back here. This one part of the school just oozes Japan. It's like a part of an old traditional Japanese estate. Even the roof is tiled. It's a very interesting, isn't it? You got this modern school, but then you've got this old traditional looking archery range. The center of attraction is the wide open veranda where the club members practice. The target field is properly maintained with its grass neatly mown. This must have been expensive. Way over at the far end stand some arrow ridden targets. I had no idea something like this was even inside Hakurio. Since I'm a member of the Go Home Club, and since it's pretty out of the way, I simply never have a reason to come to places like these. Even though your friend is a member. So, where's Tama? All the members are standing in a line, wearing white kimonos, black hakamas, and oddly shaped chest plates. Oh hey! There's Tama! Wow. I had no idea she was this good. All the arrows she shot since I came in have hit the bullseye. Wow, she's actually pretty cool. I know, right? Just not in front of people. <laughs> she really is. I mean, I was a. I do like Tama. I do enjoy her route. It was fun. Huh? Oh, no. Sorry. <laughs> How are they different? Ah, uh, yes, they were talking about different archery styles. <laughs> I love this. This whole thing is like, what the hell? It just goes to show you how powerful that Maya is that she's able to do stuff for something like that. Buy out every house in the, in the neighborhood and then completely flatten it. It's like, why? <laughs> I mean, it doesn't matter because we're in the contest anyway. I just love how she's able to rope everyone in. It's just so great. <laughs> Sumika, please. Definitely Sumika. Okay, with that decided, I'm off. Whoa! Looks like she already came to us first. You're supposed to ask that BEFORE you open the door? <laughs> Shouldn't you be apologizing? <laughs> hey, this is just how friends are, aren't they? I don't want to hear it. 
しょうがないな<笑> Rude Hey, don't mess around with that stuff Um, he's a guy. Of course he does. <laughs> Psst, don't be stupid. <laughs> exactly. Yeah! <laughs> uh, yeah, just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> What? Don't just smile and throw them out! <laughs> uh. I don't think we want to drill Milky Punch today. <laughs> no! <laughs> you don't look disgusted or sound it. <laughs> There you go. There. Now she's doing it. That face pisses me off. You're having way too much fun at my expense. I mean, that's why you hide them, right? <laughs> Wait, you threw them out? You weren't confiscating them? <laughs> What'd you come up here for anyway? Just using it as a time waster. Oh, gotcha. Maybe you haven't. <laughs> What are you doing? What are you talking about? Don't you come in here every morning to wake me up? Of course she does. How did I forget that? I mean, look at it. It's a bit of a sty. Not gonna lie. Yeah, I guess you're right. And then you grew up. <laughs> yeah, I remember all the lame board games. Space pilot Captain Gorban, you mean? Ah, yes, of course. He talked about Gorban a lot in the uh, fantasy. In the uh, dream, even. That does sound familiar. I know, right? Foul play! You're not allowed in here! <laughs> <laughs> What? What? Oh, come on, she wasn't doing no harm. Well, I guess rules are rules. Not that they need an excuse to carry Sumika away. <laughs> See you at the contest hall! Take care! <laughs> Itarashai! <laughs> <coughs> so much dust! With maids like these, who needs allergies? I'm so hungry, man! Skippy time again! Right? Right? It would be doing it if it was. <laughs> wow, what a meal. Doesn't that just look delicious? Sumika, I guess. Yota! <laughs> Go me! Do you? How should I put this? Her method may have been absolutely ridiculous. Uh. Actually, it tasted ridiculous too, but I have to say, it really conveyed her feelings to me. Aww, that's so cute! I mean, all of them were delicious of course, and from a strictly taste-based point of view, some of the others were undeniably more delicious. But still! <laughs> It's like, yeah, of course you did. It's the obvious choice. I have. 
白金はもう少し演出を勉強しなさい。No, well, you can't help it. He, he, he's, just, he's just honest. <laughs> I think I'll pass. <sighs> ということで、明日白金を自由にできるのは鏡に行けて。はい、拍手 Alright, we'll finally get to a point now where we can actually have a bit of sustained conversation. <laughs> no one's applauding. <laughs> Why did no one clap for her? I mean, yeah, he did take the easy choice, but still. Oh, there you go. I mean, there's no way that Maya made that meal all by herself, though. She hasn't made any of the meals to this point by herself. So, yeah. It is what it is. <laughs> I love it. They didn't even clap for her when it was like, give her a round of applause. But they're congratulating her now. <laughs> the winner earned the right to do whatever she wants with me for a day. That was how they had, they had advertised it. So why am I going on a date with Sumika? And why are we meeting up with a place like this? She lives right next door to me. We could have just come here together. I did consider not showing up, but she was just so excited about it. In the end, he cares about Sumika. I would have felt bad standing her up. That's the only reason I came. Well, yeah, you say that, but I think there's more to it than that, don't you guys think? I mean, she just wanted it to feel like a date, I guess. <laughs> huh? Don't run toward me and call my name at the same time! Everyone's watching! Oh, I love that derpy smile she has. It's so cute. <laughs> you dumbass. I know, right? He's terrible at this. Try not to embarrass me so much, alright? I was seriously considering running away. <laughs> and that would have been even more embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, which is why I decided not to. Anyway, do me a favor and try not to make a scene. Yep, you can't. I won't hear any protests. Yeah, yeah. So, what are we doing on this date? Well, that's what a date is, Sumika. <laughs> Just wandering around doesn't seem like much of a date. I mean, we do that all the time. <laughs> She's so basic, but that's also partly endearing. Fine, fine. Where are we going then? <laughs> Funnily enough, that's exactly where Maya goes as well, isn't it? The amusement park? <laughs> Have fun walking yourself home. <laughs> yeah, he's uh he's a bit too comfortable around you, I think, Sumika. She is dangerously close to the friend zone though, isn't she? Let's be fair. Ah uh, hey! Stop it! Don't pull on my arm! Just come you little bitch! <laughs> Well, it's a date, right? We're gonna do it. Oh, yeah? What's it like? What is? Okay. <laughs> what? Alright. What did you say? Well, that was fun. Time to go home! <laughs> 
What, you don't want to go on a roller coaster with her? Why not? Is your brain broken? We've been here a while now. We even rode that what's its name coaster 30 times. Oh, right, so this is time skip. Really? They've only been here for like two hours. <laughs> your watch is slow. <laughs> wow. Snarky much? <laughs> like I'm gonna fall for that one. <laughs> oh, is that really gonna rile him up? Shut up. Ooh, she went there. What? It looks like in the end, Sumika knows just how to push his buttons. Why, you little... You're gonna go that far over a stupid roller coaster? Alright, fine. I'll ride the damn thing. You happy now? Oh, right, it wasn't a time skip. He was just being a jerk. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? Well, guess we're coaster riding. But in exchange, if you scream, lunch is on you. Got it? <laughs> Let me guess. Takira is the only one who's going to be screaming on this roller coaster. Wait, you'll buy? Seriously? Ah, hey! Quit pulling! <laughs> yeah, I knew it. <laughs> no! Stop the ride! I want to get off! <laughs> oh, jeez, Takiru, Takiru. This is what. This is where your personality gets you. You, you know, this is all on you, right? I don't like this. I, I'm, I'm, I'm even starting to feel sick. <laughs> Those weren't screams. That was the sound of my soul weeping. That seems to be a bit mean. I think he, don't you think he suffered enough? <laughs> don't talk to me about food right now. <laughs> oh look, it's the same thing. There's a child here. Just let me sit down for a little bit. Oh man, she has no mercy. <laughs> no, really. I... It is a small lost child! Dunno. There's a little kid staring at us. Can't say he looks like the sharpest tool in the shed, honestly. Oh man, you're seeing yourself in that little kid, eh? <laughs> What's he doing? I think he probably does. Is he just gonna start crying out of nowhere? <laughs> yeah, come on, little, come on, little guy. Where are your mom and dad? Uh oh. <laughs> no, right? You can see what's coming. Oh no! <laughs> Whoa! Poor little guy. Th this kid's lost? Come on, Sumika's gonna show her motherly side. She'll show that she could be a good wife. Uh oh. This is pretty serious. 
What do you mean? Can't we just hand him over to a staff member? You feel bad for him, don't you? What can we do? There's no way we can go look for them, right? Ah, yes. The two things that should appease a crying child. <laughs> yeah, your parents will find you. <laughs> Oof! <laughs> Oof, she took that really well. <laughs> Calling her grandma. <laughs> Oh, jeez. <laughs> Little kids, man. Alright, at least he's happy now. Oh, no, don't leave me alone with him. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, don't, don't cry. Oh god, Sumik is so stupid. Now that the person being nice to him is gone, he's gonna freak out again! Oh no, no, not again! Cut it out! You can't keep just bawling forever, or everyone's gonna start calling you a crybaby! The nice lady will be right back, and then we'll find your mum and dad. So don't worry. <gasps> How dare you! Don't call me mister. I'm not that old yet. Whew, that was a close one. Disaster averted. Oh god. <laughs> she's not, now she's not taking it well. Oof. Oh no, he's gonna cry again. You idiot! Don't tell him that! <laughs> Crap! He's gonna start crying again! Oh god! Do something! Ooh. That's loud! What the? Ah, the superhero show, of course! <laughs> what? <laughs> to be honest, affecting the common sense actually seems like a good thing. The, this is a blessing from the gods! Oh my god, what, what, how's this superhero gonna show gonna work then, eh? Let's go, kid! Uh. Try and keep up, Subika! <laughs> wow, he looks like a giant peanut. I have a feeling someone's gonna get in the way <laughs> of this show. <laughs> A superhero show is exactly what will get a little kid to stop crying. Shut up! This is the good part! Red Poltergeist. <laughs> what sort of green crop circle? What? Jeez. Rafe Rangers. There you go! Boom! Explosion! Come on, Sumika, have you never honestly seen a hero show before? Come on. It's the Rafe Rangers! Haven't you heard of them? If you were still kids, you would definitely have heard of them. <laughs> it's an American remake of an old show called Paranormal Sentai Wraith Men. I don't get this, but okay. 
and that got reverse imported or something. So now it's being broadcast in Japan too. So, so nanda. Man, watching this really gets me fired up. <laughs> I don't watch it myself or anything, but this has nothing to do with age. You still like stuffed animals, don't you? Besides, look at the kid! The kid isn't saying anything. He's just got his eyes glued to the stage. His mouth is wide open and his eyes are sparkling. See? All little boys love superhero shows. Exactly. That's exactly why we're here. Right? See what I mean? Uh oh. Oh? Wow, you taking the child? Why would you take a lost child, man? Give him back, you monster! <laughs> oh, she got Sumika! I love that she be Sumika! A drove of black warriors come out of nowhere and snatch up Sumika and the kid. Where's the kid? Have fun up there! Ooh, how are the Wraith Rangers going to get out of this one? <laughs> how is cheering going to change anything? <laughs> this is nice! A real sense of live audience interaction! Normally, they plant people in the audience for this sort of thing. But they're letting inexperienced audience members up there. Now that's what I call drama! You could cut the tension with a knife. I mean, sure, Disneyland's Melindarella, Ca Melindarella Castle is pretty good, but this really gives it a run for its money. Of course it's gonna make a Disney reference. There you go, the kid's into it. Oh ho! That kid. He's doing really well. <laughs> oh my god, you think Sumika's a mother? <laughs> he thinks Sumika's his mother! <laughs> Gotta say though, this is the kind of absurd why are they threatening their hostages with a self help seminar? <laughs> Hmm. Well, I guess that's the sort of quirkiness that makes people love the show so much. Oh god. No! Maya, what are you doing? Oh no. <laughs> the most obvious Maya's ever been undercover during these dates. What the heck? Some weirdo in a trench coat just ran out onto the stage with a katana! Is this a new character? Well, that's a really good improv there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He was a little less uh, obvious about it. Or a little, you know, a little less uh, able to hide his surprise, but still. Oh god, someone stop her! She's gonna kill him! Minaru Kamui? I'm pretty sure I've heard that before. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it, the trench coat looks weird. It's not just me, is it? Wait, huh? Mook and Kino? Surely he recognizes the voice at least. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Sorry to say, I'm afraid it is. Oh jeez, run away guy, save yourself! <laughs> the poor guy! Hmm? There seem to be one, two, three, four of the same guy. I can't believe they let it go on for this long before they stopped her. Jesus. No, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> well, this is awkward. <laughs> What the hell was that? What the hell? <laughs> oh, Maya, Maya, Maya. You've ruined everyone's fun. <laughs> because you can't tell the difference between fiction and real life. Oh, dear, dear, dear. You certainly had a lot of you were having fun up there in your little chibi form. <laughs> Good thing you didn't get turned into a Neo Gazunda. <sighs> Where's the child anyway? Thanks to the kid being dragged up on stage, his parents were able to find him. And I had fun too. So everyone wins. Everyone's a winner. Come on, you should be able to know that much. Huh? Oh, oh, who knows? I mean, I know it's cold out, but he had a hat and sunglasses. Plus a face mask and a trench coat is really overdoing it. <laughs> then don't turn around. You've got that right. Well, anyway, it'll be getting dark soon. So what should we do now? Well, okay. <laughs> The beach? Sounds good to me. Never knew that. Guess we're going. Ugh. We're just gonna get cold. <laughs> Alright, fair enough then. Yeah. I guess it is. The sky has a faint orange tinge to it. The sunlight's reflecting off the water, making the waves glimmer as they roll in. Let's save it. <laughs> Why not? Random save. Unlike the view from Tachibana Park, the ocean just stretches on all the way to the horizon. Well, I can kind of make out the shapes of buildings and bridges way off in the distance, but it's still more than enough to make me think make me think about how vast the ocean actually is. Hey, you're the one who wanted to be out here, Sumika. No complaining now. I warned you, didn't I? Sorry, but I don't have a coat to lend you. Oof. <laughs> Ouch. No need to be mean about it. What's up? Why does it have to be next summer? That's true, yeah, they are seniors. But then we're just gonna be moving right along into Hakryo U, right? We're not gonna be any less busy. I guess that makes sense. No, my point is, we can come here whenever we feel like it. Assuming they don't tear the place down, of course. Really? <laughs> Sheesh, what's your deal today? Mitsurugi-san, sir. Ah, yes. Hmm? <laughs> we know why she came here. Which is why doing any other route apart from hers results in a not very nice ending for her, which is sad, really. Now that you mention it, no. 
自信たっぷりにそなたと私は絶対運命という固い絆で結ばれているにやりなんて言ってたけど心当たりあるの Frankly, it's amazing that she still remembered a promise like that when she was just a small child. I guess it just shows to show you how much of a、uh, impact that、uh, Takiru had on her life that day. Nope, none at all. Really? Yeah. So, Takiru, what do you do? What do you mean? So, no man, m o t h e r I'm not sure if I'm going to go to the h I wouldn't go that far. Hmm. I don't know. Moshi mo, Takeru chan ga Mitsurugi san to isho ni iru yo ni natta ra. Lai nen no natsu wa isho ni kore nai yo ne. True enough. Datte sa, ikura o sana najimi de mo, Mitsurugi san ni waru i mo ne. Well, we're just fortunate that this is your route. Sumika, and it's gonna be your happy ending, so yeah, you're gonna do it. <laughs> well, if you're gonna go and bring that up, it's totally possible that you'd get a boyfriend too, you know. <laughs> When you get to university, some unfortunate dude who doesn't know your true nature might fall in love with you, and you'd be so, so happy you might actually go out with him. <laughs> if that happened, You wouldn't be able to come here with me, no matter how close we once were. So, Tayone, what does that say? Osana Nazi meet the you that get a mon, eh? Give it time. That's right. Ne, so ring a yada nati o motakoto. Aru? About, about being childhood friends? <laughs> Unhappy about what? Being childhood friends? ちょっと違うけどそんな感じ。Look at her avoiding the,、uh, the question. I guess I've never really thought about that sort of thing. We've always been together after all. そうだね。私たちずっと一緒だったんだよね。Something bugging you? あ、うん。良かったのかな。悪かったのかな、なんて思って。Wow, rude much? You're seriously gonna say that to my face? あ、ごめん、そうじゃないの、そうじゃなくて、そうじゃなくて。Oh, then what did you mean? あることがきっかけで、あることに気づき始めた自分がいて、でもそのことに気づいてみたら。すんごくピンチなの<笑> I think we know what that is as well We've been childhood friends for so long I think I'm stuck in the friend zone And I want to be more Um, okay もっと早く気づいてたらこんなピンチすぐに乗り越えられたかなとか思って Well, they say, uh, is it strife? Makes a... No, that's not what I'm thinking of It's gone. It's gone. Short term memory loss strikes again. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> you're pretty dumb, you know that? <laughs> like you need to ask. Oh, alright, fine. Get over here, you. Just for a little bit, though. Wow, you're thinner than you look. He. He. Do you? Oof. You need to fatten up. Put on a couple of pounds. Then you wouldn't get so cold. I know, right? He's being complete. He's being considerate, but being a complete jerk at the same time. It's fine. Even if you get another three sumikas fatter, you'll only be as fat as I thought you were. So no one will notice. Besides, you're just skin and bones right now. <laughs> See, they're in a situation like this, and they're totally. There doesn't seem to be any romantic tension at all. This is probably what she means by dealing with it better. But if he did, 
It'd save me the trouble of having to warm you up like this. <gasps> oh my gosh, that's so cute! Hmm? Did you just say something? <laughs> oh no, then everyone get the wrong idea. Or is it the wrong idea? Hmm? All the way to the station? That was the deal. Uh, Oi! Damn it, let go! Why, you. <laughs> Absolutely not. Cut it out! You're gonna make people think that we're a couple! <laughs> I don't care! Fuck you! Oi! Knock it off! Stop pulling! Oh my goodness. Sukiyomi san! You in here? Nice, so she is. Oh wait, no. Uh, I forgot. Auto skip got turned off when I uh, saved the game. Gotta keep that up. So, what's May been up to today? Lying with a straight face like that. Scary. Oh, you don't say. Well, that's funny. Because I haven't seen her at all today. So, where is she right now? <laughs> Let me guess. She's not in a good position to meet with me right now, is she? Look, it's not like I'm upset about it or anything. And as far as I could tell, Sumika didn't even realize it was her. I <laughs> know, right? Sumika's an idiot. <laughs> but there is one very important thing I need to tell you, Tsukiyomi-san. And let me make myself crystal clear. Maya still has a lot to learn about how the real world works. Uh, hi. <laughs> I mean, what are you guys even doing? Didn't you say you did a ton of preliminary research before you came here? <laughs> you blew your cover. Well, I don't care how thorough your investigation was. You need to teach Maya some common sense. At this rate, she's never going to be a functioning member of society. Oh yeah, and another thing. Hi. <laughs> what more, really? You'd better not let Sumika find out about this. Then we're agreed. <laughs> oh dear that could have been a very bad situation after all she nearly decapitated a man today what is it Sumika carefree as ever I see hey that wasn't necessarily a bad thing so why are you here? Oh shit. <laughs> I'm not sure I recall borrowing any paper from you. Uh, he is a uh, he has conveniently wiped that memory from his memory banks. Sorry, Sumika. Guess so. Fine. How many sheets? What? I'm pretty sure I didn't use 50 pieces of paper. How much did he borrow to accumulate that much interest? That's highway robbery! <laughs> I don't need yours. We're at the brink of fighting over sheets of paper. How is that lovey-dovey? Miki-chan, Takeru-chan ga hidoi in da yo. 
I know, right? He's such a jerk sometimes. God, why did I fall in love with... Uh, I mean, uh, ni nice weather we're having. <laughs> Indeed he is. Pay attention. I haven't even said anything yet. Absolutely, Tama. I always want to know what you think. <laughs> cuddle fight? When have Sumika and I ever done anything that remotely qualifies as cuddling? She makes it sound like we were making a big scene. Wait a minute. She just admitted that they were spying on them on their date. I think that's what she's talking about. <laughs> huh? Come to think of it, what did she mean by we've been lovey-dovey lately? Wait, was she talking about what happened at the viewing platform yesterday? Did she see us? Well, yeah, they all saw you. No way. Can't be. Oh, but you're right on the money, I'm afraid, Takiru. Alright. Now it's time to get the lacrosse team together. <laughs> it's like, how dare you trick me? You worded it so weirdly. I love him. He gets love letters from everyone. <laughs> Girls and guys alike. Alright, we have a bit of a... Let me think about it. Then we'll go home with Simica, of course. Good question. Hmm? Well, kinda, yeah. So, hey, where's Simica? Where's, where's Maya? <laughs> Why is Simica's right here? What am I saying? Huh? I don't know. Oh, well, isn't that lucky? You get to be all lovey-dovey again. Something she needed to take care of? That's unusual. Ah, right, maybe uh, Sukiyomi passed on the message. I don't like the sound of that. Kinda, yeah. I'm impressed you could tell. That is the telekinetic power of childhood friends knowing each other inside and out. Oh hey, it's Tama! Well, you'd think so. Probably. She does seem to be headed to the archery range. Tama's pretty close to Ayamine. Close to Ayamine. Hmm. Hey, Sumika. You said you can always tell what's on my mind, right? Mm. Alright then. Try to guess what I'm thinking right now. Huh? <laughs> mm. Oh no. You're gonna throw her a curveball like that? <laughs> Time's up! Hiya. That was quick, to be fair. The correct answer was, you go home without me. So bye! <laughs> Sorry, Zumika. Something came up. I can just I can just ask Tama to help me. Duh! Why didn't I think of it sooner? Ayamine couldn't just outright refuse a request from Tama now, could she? Yes, but it's all about respect. Oh man, I love that. <laughs> I mean, we have to forgive them, so... You know, we can't say no. They won't let us say no, after all. No, I don't think I can accept that, can I? I can't. Sorry, I can't accept. <laughs> I 
there. Yeah, we we gotta we gotta believe in Sumika. Sumika, we're at less than half shields. We're gonna lose if this keeps up, so do your best! Yeah, you do it, Sumika. Take this! Nice. Don't let your guard down, Sumika. Because I dodged. Sorry about that, Sumika. I won't do it again. Because we're taking damage, right? It's fine. They didn't hit us. Keep charging forward. <laughs> Why are you being so kamikaze? That's suicide. <laughs> now, Sumika! The Xiao Mune disappears below the screen for an instant. If I try shooting from above, it'd be hard for him to dodge. Oh, we did it! Oh, we lost. What the? No, we lost. But, but why? The moment I jumped, the Xiao Mian's arm swung upward, clutching its knife in hand, slicing through our Kaiser like butter. Nice, well, we were going up against an experienced swordswoman. Oof. <laughs> You've got to be freaking kidding me! Oh well. <laughs> well, it is what it is. I know, right? Maya is unreal. Even in a video game, she's able to wield her, her, her blade flawlessly. Yeah, that was a good match. In the second one, Mikoto and I both piloted, but the timer ran out. The third, for the third, we let Sumiko and Maya do whatever, and I got beaten to a pulp, of course. Hey, we may have lost, but we lost together. But wasn't it fun? Of course, we have to do it again someday. Maybe if you train first, I'll spar with you. <laughs> no, it was only because I was playing with you, not against you. <laughs> What's up? What about it? Hmm? Did he? No, I didn't. Oh, <laughs> she did realize. Oh, you noticed that. Given the background music and other sounds, I thought you'd miss it. And then it hit me. <laughs> well, I figured letting the fight last a little longer would have made it more fun. Because he doesn't like losing in Valganon, obviously. I didn't think you'd like having to switch positions right after you got the hang of it. But you noticed in the end anyway, so it didn't matter. Sorry, my bad. After you get some extensive training. That's true, yes. The lacrosse game is more important at this moment in time. Yeah, you're right about that. That's definitely the more pressing issue here. Mm. <laughs> Takes it in stride, as always. She's gonna make me go jogging with her again, isn't she? I'd better sleep now then. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. <laughs> oh, okay. You gotta love how she's all so passionate about everything. 
to the roof. Wow. <laughs> There's a lot to skip, isn't there? Which is why I'm glad the skip function with this is so, uh, quick. Here we go, it's time to find the kitty cat. Oh ho! <laughs> yep. Sumika, I have a favor to ask of you. <laughs> I want to hold it too, give it to me please. <laughs> the ball transformed. Oh, she's so, she's in fangirl mode. Eee, so cute! <laughs> Stop dancing. No way. Take her to the janitor's room. Really don't want to see a little kitty cat get taken to the pound. Really? Oof. Then what do we do? Hmm? What's wrong? <laughs> yes, considering who this cat actually is, must know all too well what the janitor's like with cats. Yeah, right. As if. Oh, maybe she's hungry? Come to think of it, there wasn't any food or water in the box. I mean, that's just so irresponsible. Where's she off to now? <laughs> Oi! Sumika! Why are you carrying all that bread? I don't think cats can eat bread, actually. Back a sec, guys. I just need to use the, the use the facilities. I'll just leave you with this nice chill music, eh? I'm back! There's no way a cat can eat bread, Sumika. You bought up everything they had in the store, at the student store, didn't you? Tuna sandwiches, cutlet sandwiches, ham sandwiches, hot dog buns, sweet bean bread, jam bread, cream bread, rice ball bread, yakitori bread. <laughs> so much bread. <laughs> Wait, natto bread? When the hell did they start selling these? Aren't natto beans like those really like stringy ones? I don't care if it's the king or the queen. I don't want to eat it. <laughs> I think the meat, the cat, the cat really could only eat the meat, right? I mean, uh, yeah, I guess animals can eat bread. <laughs> and not to mention, I kind of doubt this little guy could even finish one of these things. I'm not even confident that I'd be able to muscle down such an onslaught of bread myself. Yes, you don't want to be overdone by bread. Oh, you can do that. <laughs> okay. 
Well, look who it is. <laughs> oh, Sumika. Well, that's what you get, you silly girl. <laughs> yeah, no duh. She got a little too into it, didn't she? Oh, Sumika, you're so silly. For lack of a better option, we'll just have to eat them all. She says she doesn't care. Obviously, the fish one is perfect for a cat. You've got sardines in there too? I mean, there was a tuna sandwich in there, and that's fish. <laughs> well, fine, whatever. Just feed it to her. Oh, it must look so adorable. So, what do we do with her? Fine. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> well, of course, we're going to suggest Sumika. Sumika, mind if I give her to you? Well, at least she's very willing to do it. I was begging? <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. That's what I was afraid of. But it's still better than nothing. At least I'm hung to her for a while. I wonder what she would expect. <laughs> as long as what you ask for in return is within reason. <laughs> oh no, that's not a very, uh, that's not a good laugh. What the heck? Why does that laugh sound so ominous? I know, right? I'm glad I wasn't the only one. Wow, she's already got some cat food. Wow, you're well prepared. Wait, baby food? What? Wait, what? <laughs> huh? You bought the food? <laughs> Oh, absolutely. This is a real test. Oof. Sumika's really knows what she wants, man. How is demanding I pay for it? How is demanding I pay for it any less stingy? Alright. Not like I have a choice. <laughs> I love it, man. It's like, why are you all so terrible? <laughs> Gotta be Sumika. Yeah, it'd have to be Sumika. At this rate, she's going to be in real trouble. She is making progress, but... She's just going to be a hindrance if this keeps up. Oi, Sumika! Uh, what? <gasps> Ouch! <laughs> Ooh. Uh, right in the face. <laughs> so I get beamed in the head with a ball, which knocks me out, and suddenly everyone forgets I'm even there. Wow, that's kind of mean. How could they all just leave me like that in this cold weather? <laughs> says the girl, says the girl who beamed me in the face and knocked me out. I'm just a little cold. Thanks to you guys leaving me on the ground like that. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course it's not your fault. When did you learn to blame others for your own mistakes? I don't remember ever teaching you to do that. <laughs> no, I probably didn't. Ugh, what did I do to deserve this? Do you want the abridged 
you want the short version or... <laughs> hmm? Looks like Sumika hurt her knee. Did you trip over yourself again? You only just realized this? I know, right? He can be really mean. Ugh. Sniffly. Well, we'll figure out a way to put that optimism to use. So just keep doing your best. I mean, yeah, just being there, making sure that there's a team to play. I'm glad you're so optimistic, but I don't think there is. But of course he says that to himself. Skip time. <laughs> hmm. I think we have to get in the car. I said stop the car! Get in the car now! <laughs> uh, do we wait until school ends? Uh, yeah, wait until school ends. And there's the doggo. Little borker. Right, so, uh... So I think normal ending 2 means we have to, uh, come up with a backup plan, I think. I just love how they get Mikoto. <laughs> We're gonna win! We did it! We won! Congratulations everybody! Good job! <laughs> See Mika in the toilet. That's always a fun one. Sumika wouldn't be too bad. Well, maybe Sumika's wouldn't be too bad after all. Poor Maya. She seems completely perplexed. Why does he never choose my food? Do I really not stand a chance? Studying isn't just about how much time you spend doing it. What? <laughs> Thank you, Marimo Sensei. At least you're trying to make Takiru become a somewhat decent human being. Well, I hate to say that you're gonna be wrong, Marimo Sensei, but. What? <笑><笑>というわけで、これはいただくわ。白金君は昼まで待つから。鏡さんは責任持って監督よ。わかった。オッケー。Fine. <笑> Well, here goes nothing, I guess. <laughs> you were supposed to supervise me while I worked on Marima Chan's worksheet, but you weren't any help at all. <laughs> she did say keep an eye on him, so she did her job. You were so useless, I ended up having to ask my mayor for help instead. <laughs> Oof. I believe we're near the, uh, we're getting close to the, uh, the end of the route, actually. <laughs> I 
Why does this always happen? Why does she never lock the door? <laughs> Walk home. <laughs> but they won't let us. How dare you? <laughs> oh, Mia. Here we go. As thanks for all we've done for Mia. She sets us up on a luxury cruise all on our own. It must feel really ominous. <laughs> uh, it looks good on you, I guess. <laughs> it means you clean up right we quite well, Sumika. <laughs> I just love that. We get to be on a luxury cruise liner, and all you do is make it so difficult for us to enjoy a fancy meal for once. Ordering beef bowls on a cruise, honestly. Whew. Because Sumika and Maya's roots are so similar, it's really, uh, it's really, uh, it's really not going to take that long to do Sumika's route. Maybe a video game? Ah! No, that's not what I, that's what I want! <laughs> Besides, she doesn't even have a console. What do I do? What do I do? It's birthday time. Here we go. The hot spring trip is finally here. Next to Sumika. Hey Sumika, the seat open? Like she'd say it was like she'd say it was occupied. Come on. Then I'll be taking it. I'm gonna get some rest. So wait me up when we get there. <laughs> really? Is Sumika really the best one to ask about this? I mean, she always does come to wake him up every morning, to be fair. Oh god. <laughs> Is Mana gonna be a great tour guide? What's with the applause? Yeah, where's that applause coming from? <laughs> So is Takiro actually going to stay up after all? <laughs> I guess Sumiko won't let him sleep, will she? Uh, shut up. Oh, shut up. Takeru-chan, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm tired. Leave me alone. <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! I told you to wake me up when we get there. <laughs> but you know him, right? This is what you should have expected. A real woman never goes back on her word. Yeah, it's a man. It's a real man never goes back on his word. Anyway, I'm sleepy. Don't you dare wake me up again before we get there! <laughs> and there it is. The Sumika pout. That face isn't gonna work on me. I won't let you sleep. <laughs> of course. Uh-oh. I just got a really bad feet. Whoa! <laughs> Knocked him clean out, eh? I mean, it's a really nice hot spring, isn't it? It would be great to go to a hot spring with Lot. Yeah, we didn't even get to see uh, any sort of special trip with uh, with Maya this time. 
Okay, maybe we do. I'm forgetting this. <laughs> I assume it's okay. That's okay. You know what, actually? Never mind. Why? Weird question. You're the one who keeps making those pensive, complicated looks at me. I have a feeling that, if I asked, it'll all turn out to be a dream. Then I'd wake up, and my real life would start again. Without you. That's <laughs> what it sounds like to me. I'm saying it might be. And sometimes, there are dreams you never want to wake up from, right? As selfish as that sounds. It's because I'm a coward at heart. I know I'll never understand if I don't ask, but I just can't bring myself to do it. You think? It's hard for me to say. I don't really get it myself. To be fair, with the way Maya's uh, suddenly appeared in his life, I wouldn't want her to leave either. She's really nice. You've got a serious way with words. It might sound nice when you sum it up like that, but I guess I still feel like what I'm doing is just a form of escapism. I'll ask you about it someday. But unfortunately, she doesn't have the time for that. <laughs> Maybe not. Assuming that someday ever comes. Spoilers. It won't. Yeah, I'd imagine not. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. We're here now. I believe we're approaching. Yep. The moment of truth is finally here. You. <sighs> there you go, it's like... You can you can still go after Maya. There's still time. But that would mean leaving Sumika behind, so... You're gonna have to choose. Sumika, it's you. It's you, Sumika. I can't imagine... Living without you. I'm not sure if this is what you were hoping for back then, when you said you wanted something to happen. Oh, Sumika. But, well, I'll make an effort. I'll do my best to be more than just a friend. Honestly, I can't tell for sure whether I like you or love you. <laughs> but I can say one thing for sure. This has nothing to do with time anymore. I can stay here as long as you want. I'll never leave your side. Oh. Whoa, careful. So cute. You can't keep crying forever. People might start calling you a crybaby, you know. But you see, the way this final part goes for their roots, 
is whoever you have the most interactions with, whoever you have the most choices with, you will automatically railroad onto their route. But if you play it sort of even and it's kind of hard to separate, then it will ask you to actually make a choice. So because I just went straight with Sumika and Maya both times, I, I obviously, you know, there wasn't really any build up to it. It was all just instantly. It's like, you know who you want. You've been, you've been picking them every time. Who else are you going to be with? I wouldn't make it in time, even if I ran now. <laughs> A bit late. He's literally said, it's too late to turn back now. <laughs> yeah. Well, you were explaining everything to me. While I was looking all over for you, and talking to Tsukiyomi-san, I was thinking. <laughs> and I've decided, I'm not gonna go see Mia. It would just make it more hard on all, all of them, wouldn't it? Even though she knows that she misunderstood, she still thinks it's her responsibility to go back. I can't disrespect that decision. <laughs> Even if I were to waltz on in right now, she'd probably chase me away. That's just the way she is. <laughs> Indeed she is. Well, there goes 15 minutes. Hey, Sumika. Nani? Now that it's all said and done, mind if I say something kind of wimpy? Iyo? <laughs> I want to hear it. <laughs> Honestly, I do want to see Maya again, to apologize, and to thank her. Mm. But I can't anymore. You're the only one I can tell, so I just did. <laughs> there! All done! Why don't we head home? It's pretty cold out here. So cute. It's pretty impressive though, isn't it? Incredible. How do they even do this stuff? They completely rebuilt the neighborhood all over again. All in one night. The Smitsurugi Corporation is not as a corporation to be feared, that's for certain. Seriously, those people are beyond unbelievable. Unfortunately, we're the only ones here. <laughs> hey. Nani? Your place is next door. <laughs> <laughs> it's like my second home. That counts, right? Why do I even try? <laughs> it's scary how efficient the Mitsurugi Corporation is. Almost like it was never here at all. It's literally like he said to uh, Mayor in the cave. It's literally like he's woken up from a dream and everything's back to the way it was. Maya. <sighs> Mayor, you really are an incredible person. You did this for me and Sumika, didn't you? You were so thorough in wiping out every trace of your presence. <laughs> it's kind of sad. They really did become really fast friends. But because he had to make a choice, that means that they could never be friends again. It's sad. Thank you. Thank you so much. But Maya, if you think everything's gonna go according to your little plan, you're way wrong. If you're gonna put up with your signature cool front, then we're gonna do things our way too. Sumika and I, will never, ever forget you. Because in the end, she's literally what brought them together. I mean, 
It's all thanks to you that Sumika and I could start feeling this way about each other. So you're never going to erase our memories of you. And if you don't like it, tough. <laughs> hmm? What's up? Hola. What? <laughs> huh? <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> Honestly, why did I fall in love with you again? <laughs> Excuse me? I'm afraid May has already been married off, so there's not nothing I can do about that now. Why would I do that? Wow, I guess this is her way of sort of cheering him up. No, I'm not! Yes, really! Now lay off already! <laughs> Honestly, this is the romantic route, right? <laughs> I mean it. You don't need to worry about that. You want me to prove it to you? Huh? Ooh, that made her heart skip a beat, didn't it? I can, if you want me to. Mm. Huh? Now kiss! Huh? <laughs> it's so cute. It's so very cute. Hold on, I need to say keep that safe. <laughs> Kissing time. Sumika, my childhood friend. This is one of those times where the childhood friend actually wins. <laughs> and not because they're all his childhood friends. <laughs> the girl, he's going to always be by my side, no matter what. And yet... We've never been as close as we are right now. And now, up close, I can feel a side of Sumika I never knew before. Her scent, her hair, her warmth, her skin, her breath, her eyes, and her heart. So freaking cute! Sumika. Just let the impulses take you. <laughs> Sumika sleepily opens her eyes as if in a trance and looks up at me. <laughs> I know, right? You never thought it would ever happen, didn't you? But it is, right here and now. <laughs> it's an impure dream. <laughs> wow, he's very quiet all of a sudden. <laughs> Aww. Sumika. <laughs> she always wanted this and now it's finally happening. She doesn't think it should be happening, but it is. I mean, in a sense, I'd like to think that the Maya route is actually the true canon ending of this game. Nothing against Sumika. She was actually my favorite when I played this the first time I did back in like the late 2000s. But after seeing how Maya's route pans out, it's like, it really should be the one. Because I don't like the idea of uh, Maya being trapped in an unhappy marriage that's been arranged for her. And losing out on the one boy she actually had feelings for. It's really sad when you think about it like that. But this is her route after all, so yeah, she can have this one. Sumika. 
I'm not a dream. <laughs> Ever so gently, I pull her body in close. She fits perfectly into my arms, like a key into a lock. There might have been a time in the past when we got this close to one another just on the spur of the moment or purely by accident. But it's different now. You know why? Because now there's love. I can feel her close to me. I can feel her within me. Sumika. She definitely does look kind of scared, doesn't she? She quivers slightly as I whisper into her ear. I place a hand on Sumika's chest. Now I'm pretty sure in the in the adult version, it's not a close-up of her face. It's actually, you know, there's actually a, a full screen of this. And as you can imagine, lewd things are happening. So the old ages version's like, no, 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 can't show that. Yeah, I can feel it. Sumika's arms wrap around my back and her slender body slides closer. Ah, even though all the layers of fabric, even through all the layers of fabric, I can still feel the heat of her body. No matter how much it surges forth, Sumika's warmth is endless. I brush my hand through her hair and down her long, along her cheek. So this is what Sumika's skin feels like. I've never felt it before. Aww, oh, this is so cute. Her hot breath hits my face. Such lewd noises. Sumika winces. Sumika? <laughs> so long as that's all it is. There's something wavering deep inside her eyes. Well, it's real. Sounds like you're quite the dreamer, Sumika. <laughs> I know, right? You may be romantically involved now, but there's still... You can't just erase all your childhood friend quirks. <laughs> you know it. This is such a strange feeling. There's nothing deep inside me that's... There's, there, there's nothing deep inside me that's spurring me on. I always thought my mind would go totally blank at a time like this. But it's more like I'm just filled with a profound sense of happiness. <laughs> I'll bet it is. Yeah, I guess it is. Don't give me that bashful laugh. You're gonna get me embarrassed too. <laughs> if we keep doing this to each other, we're not gonna be able to keep going. We're just holding our bodies close, but it feels so different than before. <laughs> oh, I love it. They're both virgins, so they're very inexperienced with these feelings, especially considering they only just got revealed to each other recently. Huh? Well, I'm sure just enjoying it would make him happy, to be fair. C come on, you don't need to apologize for that. You're getting worried over nothing. You should already know that doesn't matter to me. Don't worry about it. You can just do whatever comes naturally. Listen to your heart. <laughs> I mean that you can just be yourself. You have nothing to worry about. I go to pass her on the head, but decide to stroke her hair instead. I just wanted to reassure her that she could count on me. But I figured she'd probably get upset with me for treating her like a child at a time like this. Hold still. Sumika tenses up far more than she needs to. That's probably 
just how nervous she is. I put my arms around her and hold her tight. I breathe in a little, and Sumika's scent fills my lungs. <laughs> Here's the coming naturally, I take it. Sumika? Oh, there it is! The bed creaks loudly as it receives our body weight. <laughs> I do sleep in it, so it should only be night that it smells like me. <laughs> of course it does. This certainly does feel like something out of a dream. And until yesterday, it was. <laughs> so are you. Sumika places her hand on my chest. She can probably feel my heartbeat. Which means she can probably tell just how nervous I am. <laughs> That's a weird thing to say about yourself. <laughs> oh, she has plenty of sex appeal to be fair. It's just that he could never admit it because then it would definitely have made things awkward. Why'd you have to... <laughs> yep, he's just a big old liar pants. <sighs> you probably didn't know how he felt back then. Yeah, I know. Better late than never. Yeah, and I accept your forgiveness. Oh, <laughs> Sumika? <laughs> She's getting all bashful now. Huh? Sorry, did I do something wrong? Huh? Oh, Sumika, she's so cute. Sumika? Yeah, I guess she's right. Regardless of how long we've been together, or the fact that we took baths together when we were kids. Or the way she can always tell what's on my mind like a psychic. Or the way we'd occasionally st startle everyone with our bizarrely perfect comedic timing. <laughs> we usually just followed it up with some stupid bickering or screwing around. I don't think we've ever been this deeply connected on an emotional level before. I'm overflowing with love for Sumika. It's not that I was just being a coward, I don't think. It's just that I'd lost sight of it amidst all the things we've been through. People say you don't know what's the most important to you until it's gone. And in that respect, I guess I'm pretty lucky. And yeah, I've lost my fair share of things that were important to me. But those were things I chose to give up willingly. So in the end, I've still been pretty fortunate. And so, with that in mind, now that I've found the person who means the most to me, I want to cherish every moment as much as I can. Without thinking, I gave Sumika a kiss on the forehead. <laughs> oh, Sumika! Sorry for making you wait so long. We lie down together and I embrace her. I want to stay like this for a while, basking in the warmth of, our, of her love. I just got a big old smile on my face here. <sighs> Sumika.
Simica. Nani? What should we do tomorrow? Nano Hanashi. Oh, come on. Are you really falling behind already? <laughs> Where are we going to go on our date, silly? <laughs> Aren't we going to spend Christmas together? <laughs> it's a little early to be playing dumb. Oh, they've just had a very emotional night together. Of course, they're. Uh, of course, it's all right to be a little bit out of it. So, what should we do? There's somewhere you'd like to go. <sighs> Don't say the amusement park again. <laughs> Have you not given this any thought at all? <laughs> Great! Oh? Okay then! We're doing that first! <laughs> Ooh, good thinking! There's lots of Christmas specials! <laughs> what?! She really loves the beach, doesn't she? It's gonna be really cold this time of year. Well, let her eat cake. <laughs> There's an idea. It is Christmas after all. She's giving it a lot of thought now. Where? Okay then, let's do all of it. <laughs> we'll do everything you want, Sumika. We'll watch a movie, go shopping, eat cake, and visit the beach. And then after that, we'll go to that magical place and wait for Santa to show up. <laughs> We've got all the time in the world, after all. <laughs> really? <laughs> She's got plenty. This may be the only way we know how to live. But we're fine with this. Of course. <laughs> no. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Sorry, I wasn't. <laughs> yeah, we'll be just fine. Come on, hurry it up. The movie's about to start. That's an interesting outfit. It's cute though. Jeez. You've always got to be such a slowpoke. Oh, really? What is the problem? <laughs> then, what is it? Huh? Oh, my bad. Well, he is an idiot. Sh shut up, dude. Was it a romance? Well, the plot twists were well paced, and the action scenes felt tense. Everything about it screamed masterpiece. <laughs> I'm talking about the movie I wanted to see! Why the hell we have to see a chick flick? Yeesh, I told you. I knew it was a chick flick. Come on, you had fun too, right, Takuru? You can say it. That doesn't suit you at all. You should have gone to the Winter Break Manga Festival or something. <laughs> you probably would. <laughs> ah, hey! Buy it for me. <laughs>
Doesn't seem like Santa's coming. <laughs> I love that. Oh, come on. We always came up here and waited for him when we were kids, remember? Santa Claus is totally real, though. Absolutely real. When was that again? Right, right. You think anyone else is waiting for him? <laughs> so long as it's little kids, it's fine, right? Why not? <gasps> it is! It's actually snowing! Oh my god! Whoa, you're right! Guess it has been getting pretty cold. Come on, the timing's perfect. <laughs> You've been with me all day. I haven't had a chance to buy you anything! How could he buy something when you're there with him? <laughs> Whoa, you're that upset about this? <laughs> oh, how kind of you. It is Christmas, after all. Hmm? <laughs> I know, right? He's always been there for you. Sumika. Oh. So cute. <laughs> so cute. I love it. Oh, animated. We met in this town. Grew up in this town. Said goodbye in, in this town. And now... We've been bound together. The times we laughed. The times we cried. The times we hurt others and were hurt ourselves. All of these memories are living proof that we've come this far. Even if the flow of time washes it all away. Even if one day these memories should fade. As long as I'm with you, I know I'll be able to walk on toward a shining future. We've been raised up and driven forward by so many people and so many emotions. And now at last, we've been united. Sumika, as long as I'm with you, <laughs> Literally, <laughs> we did most of those scenes during May's route, so this was pretty short. Yeah. Well, apart from Common Route 2, I've finally completed Love Love Extra. <laughs> oh boy. I know it took me a while to get this far, but I'm glad you guys were here for it. I'm mainly talking about those on YouTube watching the VOD, of course. <laughs> oh boy. But of course, the game's only half finished. If you can believe that. Anyone who's played this game before can tell you that. It's only half done. 
So I didn't actually need to take those screenshots during the game. I could have literally got there after. <laughs> ah, well. I mean, I have to admit, I did quite enjoy all the routes. How would I rank them? I think I'd rank them... Maya first. Ayamine second. Tama third. Sumika fourth. And class rep fifth. I think that's how I'd rank them. But it is hard. It is hard to place them, or rank them, I should say, because they were all enjoyable routes. But I would say Maya would definitely be the best one. That's just me, though. Actually, despite how much I really liked Tama as a character, I'd probably say hers was the weakest, actually. So, Maya... I mean, class reps was pretty nice. But then it also depends on if you're, if you're fine with that sort of character. Incredibly strict. <laughs> but good at heart. Maya, Ayamine, Sumika, class rep, and Tama. But that does not in any way mean that's the way I'd rank the girls as well. <laughs> Just so we're clear on that, if anyone has any uh, objections to my ranking. Of course, we still have half the game to finish now. But we'll definitely leave that for uh, next time. To think. Also, it was interesting because I I only just realised that this game was got a new publisher, and they re-released this game as a alternative, even though it's pretty much the exact same game. It's kind of weird. It's fine, I don't mind having this one. Here we go, we're gonna have, I think we'll get a bonus scene now. Or maybe not. <laughs> Extras. Clear list. See, I just missed common ending two. And then we have six endings for Unlimited. Ah, there we go. Select image language. There you go. Notice how Sumika's not there. It's kind of interesting that, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, like I said, that's it for that.